Hi, in this part I'll continue with editing this image and I'll duplicate it. Then I'll go to Colors, Curves, and here I'll select a preset that I made. And you see how this curve is, the shape of the curve here. Now have in mind that uh, every image is different and uh, you might need to play around with this curve to achieve an effect like that but you see the shape of the curve here I'm going to click OK and next I'll go to colors again select curves and select this preset and you see the curve here now let's remove this and show you how you can do that just click somewhere here make a point like that and drag and you see how this works and then click OK after that, I'll add an alpha channel to the image, zoom in a little bit, and here I'll select the eraser tool with a fuzzy brush and start erasing to get the original color of the eyes. Now you can do this with a layer mask or selection, but this will work too. And if you go too far, you can click on anti-erase. Let's try the other right here. Now you can also change the color of the eyes, I showed that in one of my previous tutorials, but I won't do it here, I'll leave it the way it is. That was too far. Let's zoom out now and um, you see how we erase the eyes on this image and the layer below and now let's turn on the wall here and you see how the image looks. Let's chain these two layers together, grab the move tool and we can adjust exactly where the image is positioned behind the wall. Let's leave it like this. And now in the next part, I'll show you how uh, you can create a text that it's uh, embedded into the wall. And after that, we're going to start editing the wall and create some thickness here, some falling pieces and things like that. Bye for now.